Welcome back viewers, where we delve into the lives of the rich and famous. Today, we will explore the world of multi-talented artist Common. From his chart-topping films to his award-winning acting career, Common has solidified his status as a cultural icon. But what does his lifestyle actually look like? First Stop Common's residence is nothing short of spectacular, with large rooms, high ceilings, and luxurious amenities everywhere. From the elegant marble floors to the modern home theater, every detail exudes sophistication and style. All the details you need are right here in this video. Let's dive in now. As of March 2024, Common, a prominent American musician and actor, boasts a net worth of $45 million, solidifying his status as a major player in the entertainment industry. Common's journey began in the early 1990s under the stage name Common Sense, where he swiftly garnered attention for his distinctive style and profound lyrics. His debut album, Can I Borrow a Dollar? 1992, served as his introduction to the hip-hop scene, laying the foundation for his future success. However, it was his subsequent albums, notably, Resurrection, 1994, and, like Water for Chocolate, 2000, that elevated him to new heights of acclaim and recognition within the industry. What distinguishes Common from many of his peers is his commitment to addressing weighty themes such as love, spirituality, and social justice in his music. This artistic integrity has earned him widespread praise, with his 2005 album, Be, receiving critical acclaim and garnering multiple Grammy nominations, including for Best Rap Album. Not content to limit himself to the realm of music, Common ventured into acting, making significant strides on the silver screen. He graced audiences with memorable performances in films like, Smoke and Aces, 2006, American Gangster, 2007, and the historical drama, Selma, 2014, where he portrayed civil rights leader James Bevel. His role in, Selma, earned him widespread acclaim and led to his collaboration with John Legend on the powerful anthem, Glory, which clinched the Academy Award for Best Original Song in 2015. In addition to his musical and acting pursuits, Common has also proven himself as a talented author, with several books to his name, including the reflective memoir, Let Love Have the Last Word. Lonnie Rashid Lin, famously known as Common, entered this world on March 13, 1972, at Chicago Osteopathic Hospital, nestled in Chicago's Hyde Park neighborhood. Born to Mahalia Ann Hines, an esteemed educator and former principal of John Hope College Preparatory High School, and Lonnie Lin, a former ABBA basketball player turned youth counselor, Common's early life was deeply rooted in the vibrant culture of Chicago. Raised in the Calumet Heights neighborhood, he experienced the challenges of a childhood shaped by his parents' divorce when he was just six years old. Despite this upheaval, Common's father remained an influential figure in his life, even securing him a job with the Chicago Bulls during his teenage years. Common's journey into the world of music began in 1991 when he embarked on a solo rap career under the moniker Common Sense. His debut single, Take It Easy, hit the airwaves in 1992, paving the way for his first album, Can I Borrow a Dollar? However, it was his sophomore effort, Resurrection, released in 1994, that catapulted him into the spotlight, earning both commercial success and critical acclaim. The mid-90s marked a period of controversy and conflict for Common, particularly sparked by his song, I Used to Love Her, which ignited a feud with Westside Connection, leading to a fiery exchange of diss tracks. Undeterred by the turbulence, Common continued to hone his craft, releasing his third album, One Day It'll All Make Sense, in September 1997. Collaborating with renowned artists such as Lauryn Hill and De La Soul, the album garnered widespread praise for its poignant lyricism and soulful beats, solidifying Common's reputation as a lyrical master. In 1999, Common made a pivotal move to New York City after signing a major label recording contract with MCA Records. Immersing himself in the vibrant music scene of the Big Apple, he collaborated extensively with a collective of musicians known as the Soulquarians, led by Questlove. This collaboration laid the groundwork for his fourth album, Like Water for Chocolate, released in 2000. The album marked a major commercial breakthrough for Common, earning him his first gold record and expanding his fanbase far beyond the confines of hip-hop purists. In 2002, Common, the acclaimed Chicago hip-hop artist, unveiled his highly anticipated fifth album, Electric Circus. The project, although eagerly awaited by critics, didn't quite match the commercial success of his previous hit, Like Water for Chocolate, selling less than 300,000 copies. Electric Circus, 
showcased Common's bold experimentation with various genres, blending hip-hop with elements of pop, rock, electronic, and neo-soul. While some critics lauded the album's ambitious vision, others found themselves divided, criticizing Common for straying too far from his established sound. Despite the mixed reviews, Electric Circus marked Common's second and final release with MCA Records before the label's transition to Geffen Records. In early 2004, Common made a notable appearance on fellow Chicagone Kanye West's debut album, The College Dropout, featuring on the track, Get M High. Around this time, he also announced his signing to West's newly formed label, then known as Good Music. The collaboration with West proved fruitful, as Common's subsequent album, B. Produced primarily by West, achieved gold status and earned four Grammy nominations in 2005. Common, the acclaimed rapper, has seamlessly transitioned into a thriving film career, solidifying his status as a versatile talent in the entertainment industry. With a multitude of roles under his belt, Common has showcased his acting chops in an array of films, including Run All Night, Suicide Squad, Happy Feet 2, New Year's Eve, The Odd Life of Timothy Green, Barbershop, The Next Cut, and Now You See Me. His journey into acting began with television appearances, making his on-screen debut in the American UPN sitcom, Girlfriends. From there, he expanded his repertoire with roles on the same network's show, One on One, portraying a drama class instructor. Common's versatility shone through as he guest starred on the ABC series, Scrubs, demonstrating his ability to seamlessly transition between comedic and dramatic roles. In 2007, Common made his breakthrough on the big screen. Starring alongside Ryan Reynolds, Jeremy Piven, and Alicia Keys in the crime drama, Smoke and Aces. He continued to impress audiences with his performances in high-profile films such as American Gangster, alongside Denzel Washington and Russell Crowe. Continuing his successful partnership with Kanye West, Common released his seventh LP, Finding Forever, on July 31, 2007. While the album garnered a nomination for Best Rap Album at the Grammy Awards, it ultimately lost to West's graduation. However, Common secured his second Grammy win for the track, Southside, which clinched the 2008 Grammy Award for Best Rap Duo or Group Performance. In the build-up to his eighth album, initially titled, Invincible Summer, Common surprised fans at a Temple University concert by announcing a change to Universal Mind Control. Despite its scheduled release date of June 24, 2008, the album faced delays. Nevertheless, anticipation remained high, with Common receiving two Grammy nominations at the 52nd Annual Grammy Awards in late 2009. These nominations included Best Rap Performance by a Duo or Group for Make Her Say, featuring Kid Cudi and Kanye West, and Best Rap Album for Universal Mind Control, signaling continued recognition for his contributions to the genre. In July 2011, Common, the seasoned hip-hop artist, made waves with the release of his first single, Ghetto Dreams, signaling the imminent arrival of his next album. This anticipation only grew with the unveiling of his second single, Blue Sky, in October of the same year. Despite parting ways with good music in 2011, Common's presence remained felt as he contributed to the label's inaugural compilation album, Cruel Summer, released in 2012. Throughout his career, Common's lyrical prowess has often stirred discussions within the rap community. In 2012, he dropped the track, Sweet, off, The Dreamer, The Believer, which subtly criticized rappers who incorporated singing into their music, though not specifically aimed at Canadian artist Drake. In January 2014, Common made headlines once again by announcing his 10th studio album, Nobody Laughs, entirely produced by his longtime collaborator, No ID. Originally intended as an EP, Common hinted at collaborations with Vince Staples, James Fondleroy, and promising newcomers from his hometown of Chicago, with the album concept drawing inspiration from the city's vibrant culture. Same year 2014, Common achieved a career milestone with his involvement in the critically acclaimed film, Selma where he not only co-wrote the Oscar-winning song, Glory, but also portrayed 1960s civil rights leader James Bevel. His poignant performance earned him widespread praise and further cemented his standing as a respected actor in Hollywood. In October 2015, Common expanded his reach in the film industry by signing a two-year contract with HBO, allowing him to establish his own film production company, Freedom Road Productions. This venture underscored his commitment to fostering diverse storytelling and amplifying underrepresented voices in cinema. Year later, in 2016, Common treated fans to his 11th studio album, Black America Again, 
released under Def Jam Recordings. This project featured guest appearances by the legendary Stevie Wonder, adding further depth to Common's already rich musical repertoire. Branching out into new musical territories, Common ventured into jazz in 2018, forming the ensemble August Green alongside Carrium Riggins and Robert Glasper. Their self-titled album, August Green, dropped shortly after, showcasing Common's versatility and willingness to explore diverse genres. Continuing his musical journey, Common released his 12th solo studio album, Let Love, in 2019, marking another milestone in his illustrious career. This joint release with Loma Vista Recordings and Concord Records showcased Common's evolution as an artist while staying true to his roots in hip-hop. In 2020, Common continued to push boundaries with the joint release of A Beautiful Revolution Part 1, featuring collaborations with singer PJ, Black Thought, and Lenny Kravitz. This nine-track album underscored Common's commitment to using his platform to inspire change and promote unity. Following up on the success of A Beautiful Revolution PT1, Common released A Beautiful Revolution PT2 in 2021, featuring guest vocals from Jessica Kerr Moore. This album further solidified Common's position as a trailblazer in the rap game, drawing acclaim for its thought-provoking lyrics and soulful beats. In August 2023, Common's enduring influence in the hip-hop community was recognized when he was featured in the hip-hop 50th anniversary edition of Men's Health magazine, alongside esteemed artists such as Method Man, Wiz Khalifa, Ludacris, Busta Rhymes, and 50 Cent. Besides successes in music, there have been significant advances in the field of acting. Common continues to boldly participate in many different business fields. Business. In 2006, Common, the multifaceted artist, stepping into the world of fashion. He became the face of the Gap's fall collection, gracing posters in stores and embodying the brand's cool and casual aesthetic. Later that year, he took to the stage for the Gap's Holiday in Your Hood themed Peace Love Gap event, showcasing his talent not only as a musician but also as a fashion icon. In February 2007, Common further solidified his presence in the fashion industry by signing a lucrative deal with New Era to promote their latest line of layers equipped baseball caps adding a touch of urban flair to the classic headwear. His partnership with New Era underscored his status as a trendsetter and style influencer. But Common's ventures weren't limited to fashion alone. In 2008, he made waves in the advertising world by starring in a television commercial for the luxurious 2008 Lincoln Navigator. Exuding sophistication and class, his cameo in the NBA 2K8 video game in the NBA blacktop mode further showcased his crossover appeal captivating audiences both on and off the court. Fall of 2008 saw Common delving into the world of technology, appearing in a commercial for Microsoft Zune, where he drew parallels between his own hit song, Universal Mind Control, and the iconic track, Planet Rock, by hip-hop pioneer Africa Bambata. Additionally, he lent his star power to the Diesel campaign for their new perfume. Only the Brave, embodying the essence of strength and resilience. Not content to limit his creativity to music and fashion, Common ventured into the realm of entrepreneurship in December 2008, launching a cutting-edge clothing line in collaboration with Microsoft called Software. Inspired by 1980s computers, the software line combined retro aesthetics with modern sensibilities, appealing to tech-savvy fashionistas and nostalgic enthusiasts alike. In September 2011, Common added another feather to his cap with the publication of his memoir. One day it'll all make sense, through Atria Books. The book offered readers an intimate glimpse into Common's life, exploring the profound influence of his relationship with his mother on his journey to success. Continuing his literary endeavors, Common released his second memoir, Let Love Have the Last Word, in May 2019. Delving deeper into his personal experiences, the book delved into his relationships with his daughter Omoye, romantic partners, and parents, shedding light on his ongoing quest to understand the complexities of love. Through his writing, Common offered readers a poignant and introspective look at his life, inspiring others to reflect on their own journeys of love and self-discovery. Ladies and gentlemen, this is probably the part we look forward to the most. Now we take you on an exclusive tour of his residence. Mansion in Los Angeles. Nestled on a sprawling 15,000-square-meter plot of land in the prestigious Hollywood Hills is a magnificent villa owned by the renowned artist Common. This stunning residence spans approximately 4,492 square feet and boasts six bedrooms and five bathrooms, offering ample space for comfortable living. As you approach the property, a grand driveway welcomes you, with enough room to accommodate up to 10 cars, 
making it perfect for hosting gatherings or events. Beyond the driveway lies a spacious backyard, large enough to host a game of touch football or simply bask in the California sunshine. The mansion features an open floor plan, with oak floors lending warmth and elegance to the main living areas. Large sliding doors seamlessly connect the indoor and outdoor spaces, allowing for easy access to the expansive backyard and the inviting swimming pool. The formal living room boasts streamlined beamed and vaulted ceilings, while the dining room offers unobstructed views of the picturesque valley below. A fully equipped chef's kitchen awaits culinary enthusiasts, complete with designer stainless steel appliances and a generous dining table for hosting guests. The primary suite is a true sanctuary, with floor-to-ceiling glass windows providing breathtaking views of the surrounding landscape. A private staircase leads to the rooftop, offering 220-degree panoramic views from the valley to the ocean. The suite also features a private outdoor terrace, a spacious walk-in closet with custom built-in features, and a spa-like ensuite bathroom with a soaking tub, shower, and double vanity. Designed with the needs of a musician in mind, Two of the bedrooms are soundproofed and equipped for recording studios, providing the perfect creative space for Common to hone his craft. The home is outfitted with modern technology, including solar power, a Crestron sound system, and a premium security system, ensuring both comfort and peace of mind for its occupants. Outside, the grounds are equally impressive, with an expansive gated driveway, motor court, lush grassy lawn, and a pool and spa for relaxing and entertaining. Outdoor seating and dining areas, along with a fire pit, create the perfect ambiance for gatherings with friends and family. This extraordinary residence presents a rare opportunity to own a centrally located and exclusive home in the heart of the Hollywood Hills. Just minutes away from Los Angeles' finest restaurants and shopping destinations. Apartments in the South Loop Grammy-winning rapper and actor Common is making headlines as he faces foreclosure on one of his two apartments in a South Loop apartment complex. Public records reveal that Common and Dudley, his partner, bought the 12th floor apartment in 2008 for $402,000, shortly after purchasing another apartment on the 16th floor for $446,000. However, apartment 16 was not later confiscated. Bank of America began the foreclosure process after Common defaulted on its 12th floor apartment, which had a remaining mortgage balance of more than $345,000 as of March. Despite the payments stable since March, the lender filed a foreclosure lawsuit in Cook County Chancery Court on June 28, seeking to gain ownership of the apartment. Representatives for Common and Bank of America have not responded to requests for comment, leaving the situation uncertain. Foreclosure documents indicate that the apartment was labeled, owner-occupied, but reports from 2010 show that Common attempted to rent it out for $2,500 per month. Common's real estate broker said at the time that both apartments were purchased as investments and that the rapper had never lived there. The 1248-square-foot two-bedroom apartment boasts a plethora of premium features. From custom cabinet lighting to built-in closets, every detail exudes luxury and style. The floor-to-ceiling windows offer stunning views of the iconic Field Museum. Adding a touch of sophistication to the space. Additionally, the apartment includes a separate study, office, providing a serene retreat for work or relaxation. Step outside onto the balcony and soak in the ambiance of the bustling city below. Inside, the main room boasts a master bath complete with a lavish stone fountain, creating a spa-like oasis in the heart of the city. However, despite these attractive amenities, the apartment is facing financial difficulties, underscoring the challenges that even well-known figures in the real estate market can encounter. This situation serves as a reminder that financial stability is not guaranteed, regardless of fame or success. Activities and philanthropy, Common, the esteemed artist, is not only known for his music and acting prowess but also for his passionate advocacy for various social causes. A committed vegan and animal rights advocate, Common has lent his voice to campaigns championed by PETA, People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, appearing in print ads urging people to, think before you eat. Additionally, he has used his platform to promote vegetarianism in a documentary titled Holistic Health for the Hip-Hop Generation, emphasizing the importance of mindful eating. Beyond animal rights, Common is deeply involved in HIV, AIDS awareness through his affiliation with the Knowing is Beautiful movement. He has participated in projects such as the Yes We Can music video, which supported Barack Obama's candidacy, and has pledged to eschew anti-gay lyrics and promote positive masculinity in his music.
The artist's dedication to social causes extends to his founding of the Common Ground Foundation, a nonprofit organization aimed at empowering underprivileged youth to become leaders and contributing members of society. Through various programs focused on leadership development, education, creative expression, and literacy, the foundation seeks to uplift disadvantaged communities. In 2014, Common Ground Foundation initiated the AH! Massive Music Festival in Chicago's Union Park, providing a platform for artistic expression and community engagement. Despite a brief hiatus, the festival returned in 2016, reaffirming its commitment to fostering positive change through music and culture. Inspired by his experiences performing at prisons and advocating for criminal justice reform, Common established Imagine Justice, another nonprofit organization dedicated to combating injustice and empowering communities. Through initiatives addressing mental health, civic engagement, and the transformative power of art, Imagine Justice strives to affect meaningful change in society. Amid the COVID-19 pandemic, Common launched the We Matter 2 social media campaign in collaboration with Imagine Justice, drawing attention to the plight of incarcerated individuals and advocating for their safety and well-being. Through short films featuring prisoners expressing their concerns about the spread of the virus, the campaign aims to raise awareness and drive action to address the urgent needs of those behind bars. Furthermore, Common has used his artistry to amplify social justice causes. As evidenced by his participation in the award-winning documentary Bars for Justice, filmed in Ferguson, Missouri. He has also performed at significant events such as the March for Our Lives Anti-Gun Violence March and the 50th anniversary of Martin Luther King Jr.'s death, using his platform to advocate for change. Despite facing criticism for his alleged involvement in anti-union efforts, Common remains steadfast in his commitment to social justice and continues to use his influence to advocate for marginalized communities and amplify their voices on a global stage. Personal Life Common, the esteemed artist known for his lyrical prowess and acting talent, is also an avid sports enthusiast, particularly when it comes to the Chicago Bulls and the Chicago Bears. As a devout Christian, he finds solace and community in his faith, attending services at the Trinity United Church of Christ in Chicago, where he draws inspiration and spiritual guidance. In May 2019, Common had the honor of delivering the Spring Commencement Address at Florida Agricultural and Mechanical University, FAMU, where he shared words of wisdom and encouragement with graduating students. Following his inspiring speech, FAMU bestowed upon him an Honorary Doctor of Fine Arts, DFA, degree, recognizing his remarkable contributions to the arts and his commitment to excellence. During his time at FAMU, Common pursued studies in the School of Business and Industry, furthering his academic pursuits. Family holds a special place in Common's life, particularly his relationship with his daughter, Omoye. Born in 1997 to Common and his former partner, Kim Jones, Omoye has been a source of joy and inspiration for her father. However, the road to fatherhood hasn't always been smooth, as Common candidly shared in his 2019 memoir. He opened up about the challenges of co-parenting and the profound moment when his daughter expressed feelings of abandonment. This heartfelt conversation served as a turning point in their relationship, strengthening their bond and deepening their understanding of each other. Omoye's graduation from Howard University marked a momentous milestone, and Common took to social media to express his pride and joy. Sharing an Instagram reel capturing the celebratory moment, Common celebrated his daughter's remarkable achievement and encouraged her to embrace the opportunities that lie ahead. Over the years, Common has been romantically linked with several high-profile figures, including Erica Badu, Taraji P. Henson, and Serena Williams. Each relationship brought its own joys and challenges, contributing to the artist's personal growth and experiences. His most recent romance with comedian Tiffany Haddish blossomed from a friendship forged on the set of the film, The Kitchen. After initially connecting on the dating app Bumble, their relationship gradually evolved, eventually culminating in a public confirmation from Haddish on a podcast. Despite their split in November 2021, Common and Haddish remain grateful for the time they shared and continue to cherish the bond they formed. Let us know what you think about Common by leaving your comments below. We hope you found this video useful. Don't forget to leave a like, share and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this video and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.